Everywhere she goes, it seems there is one song that follows. After last night's performance, she is the whole nation's hero. But of course, there's no one prouder than Mum. The Kelly family, now all back home in Hanwell, West London, just 10 miles from Wembley, to continue the celebrations. When Ella Toon scored, I thought, how proud must her parents be? Because we were all so proud. And then when Chloe scored, I was, oh, I was ecstatic. I cried. It was just, oh, mate, I, can't, I just can't put it into words. It was here that it all began for England's match winner, but she didn't have your typical football upbringing. The estate's local pitch was in a cage, and back then, the surface was gravel. It's on this very pitch that Chloe Kelly learned to play football from the age of seven with her five older brothers and their mates. And it's that experience that she says made her the player she is today, teaching her creativity, physicality, and the skills to get out of tight spaces. She used to come in, she had cuts on her knees, she was always bounced off of the, the cage floors, and I used to say to her, well, don't go then. And she'd still go back the next day and she'd, yeah. Did you mind her no, playing I didn't. Like that? No, I didn't care, because she, I know she was tough as old boots. Her first club was QPR, after being spotted at a school tournament. I'm just so proud of Chloe and the team. Julie Curley was her PE teacher and says she always knew Chloe would do something special. I remember her first day so clearly. Um, I walked through the playground and I could see this young blonde girl uh, doing keepy uppies in the playground and a large group of people gathered around her and I thought, wow, like this, this girl has skills, who is she? Um, and little did I realise just quite how skillful she was. Despite those skills, it was touch and go as to whether she'd even be at the Euros after a career-threatening knee injury last year put her out of action until April. But this is someone who doesn't give up. She's just really, really humble. She's hardworking. She's really coachable, which is great. And um, like I say, when she, she goes onto the pitch, she's just like, a, you know, she's got this street fighter determination. And, it and now it's not just her goal people are talking about. It's in! But her celebration. There really is only one Chloe Kelly and she's not going to let this moment pass her by. Let's go party. Ivor Bennett, Sky News in Hanwell, West London.